Hi, my name is Kelly Strauss from Summit Hardwood Flooring and Supply in Prior Lake, Minnesota. Welcome to our showroom. Basically, our whole philosophy is, is to educate you. I mean, it really is. We want to make sure when you leave here that you've gotten as much information in order to make the best decision you can. It's that simple. I've been in the business for almost 25 years. I've installed sanded finished floors. Um, you know, we sell to contractors, so the contractors I'm always experienced dealing with technical questions, how to deal with issues that we have on homes. You know, so, I mean, I've been through an NWFA training. I've, uh, you know, we're a member of the National Wood Flooring Organization. So, you know, we keep up with everything that's available to us as far as new products, new processes um, that are available to, to the homeowners and to the contractors. If you have a lot of children, underage, big dogs, floors will scratch. They will dent. It, it's wood is not like concrete. A darker floor will tend to show more scratches and wear and tear and dust. Um, if you go more to the lighter tones, that kind of hides it, minimizes the traffic areas that you see developing over time. It's also about grain. It's also about texture. You know, uh, when we start talking with clients about what their cabinet scheme is, you know, a lot of people, we may have, say, an oak cabinet pattern. Well, an oak pattern on a cabinet goes well with another oak floor or a hickory floor, woods that have similar grain. Because when you start talking about color and grain and contrast, we always try to say to complement the grain tones, you know, let them kind of be the same and then let the color be, be the variation. Because sometimes when you have an oak wood and say comparable to a tight grain wood like a maple, not only is the grain the contrast, the color is the contrast and they just don't complement each other very well. So we try to push people in the direction of saying, okay, what is your cabinets? What are your countertops? What is your trim package? What are your doors? You know, a lot of homes have a golden oak package. You know, the old brown golden oaks and they're not gonna change their doors and their casings, but they wanna change their floors and paint their walls. So now we have to try to come up with some ideas of what will complement it, but yet modernize it. If it's a remodel situation and you're keeping your cabinets, do you have a picture of your cabinets, a picture of your trim? Can you bring a piece in? Sometimes I have an opportunity to talk to the client before they come in and I said, can you bring something with me? Um, are you replacing your countertops? Can you bring a piece of the granite that you kind of like? A lot of people can't afford to hire a designer. So therefore they're trying to figure out how do I paint my walls? How do I pick my countertops? How do I pick my floors? You start dealing with a lot of colors, tones, textures, and it can be really confusing of how to put the puzzle together what's the most important piece of the puzzle and let's build around it. So say the wood floor is gonna be the most important of it, well let's start out with your floor because you're starting with a clean slate there, then I'll send you with samples and if you pick one out, then you can go to your tile guy, then you can go to your paint guy, then you can go to your cabinet guy, and then you start to build your palette of colors, textures, and tone around that one thing that you feel is very important.